Hello everybody, I am back. Welcome to a new series of the Nico Loves Linux show. And I've actually got a lot of news for today. So first of all, let's quickly go through them, then I'll talk about them. I'm starting a podcast. I am doing an arena, a contest to actually win, win a, star, a light laptop, which I've got there. Then I'm also doing a course uh, that is like if you want to get started with actually contributing to KDE videos and articles but also some exercises on actually how to get involved maybe with an example on how to make your first merge request this sort of idea but we'll go through it. I've also changed state I am no longer in Italy I am now in Stockholm Sweden another completely different country and this has some real consequences that we'll go through and finally I want to talk about some of the things that I had to buy to make all of this work and also some of the uh, advancement that I would like to see in my equipment so a lot of things starting with the first one which is a podcast I am starting a podcast and it's a podcast that goes out every day it's nine to ten minutes so not a lot and the idea is that you quickly listen to it while it's going to university or work and make sure that you're always up to date to whatever's happening in the Linux world. You can all already um, listen to the trailer, which is better edited than this video, so go check it out. It's currently on Anchor, but it will get also, there's an RSS feed if you use like uh, some podcasting application, it will be on Spotify, Google, um, podcasts, Apple uh, podcasts, all of that st stuff is coming. Then I'm doing this contest. So the idea, which was the idea since from the very beginning, is to give away the starlight to uh, the people that actually onboards the best into KDE. What do I mean by that? There will be a set of things that you can do to actually get involved in KDE if you aren't already. So like bug triaging, translations, making patches, bug fixes, and all of those things will earn you some points. And after a set of time, the winner with most points will actually be awarded the laptop. So that's the idea. It will be announced uh, fully when I actually release the review of the laptop, which is going to be uh, soon, in September at least. And hopefully that will be a nice way actually to get people onboarded and hopefully to also give somebody a new laptop that uh, he might need. Then, if you currently uh, check my channel on actually how to get started with KDE, because that's not super easy to do, there's only one video, which is this one, and it's about setting up the developer environment, which is very nice to have, but it's not enough. I would actually like to do a course, uh, which means, yes, just videos explaining how to set everything properly up, but also some article with commands that you can copy paste, so it's easier even without watching the video. But I would also make sure that, uh, you know, you actually understand everything that I'm telling you. So like some exercises at the end of the course to make some example merge requests to make sure that you've understood everything and always with ability to pick me or other KD contributors if they want, uh, if something goes wrong. So that's the idea. Uh, it's not something that I'm working on with KD, it's just my thing because I'm not sure whether it's a good idea or not yet. So I'd like to start this up and then see how it goes before uh, starting the onboarding pro process for this project to KDE if that's appropriate. So this again should start within September. I will start recording the videos, writing the articles, and if you'd like to help, just hit me up. Then I left my city. I am not longer in Italy at all. I'm in Stockholm. Uh, studying at the Stockholm University. This is a nice picture that I took in Stockholm. This has a lot of side effects actually. As an example, well, I could only bring some of my stuff with me and certainly not the green screen, the lights, which was quite an issue, but we'll get to it. And also, uh, you know, like the computers, I had to leave some of them in Genoa, but who cares, right? 
Also, just before um, going away, just before the exams, I held this talk at PyCon, which is the largest Italian uh, talk, um, you know, conference about Python. And it's about writing any Python program in just one line and only using lambdas. Uh, 30 minutes long if you're interested in Python. Check it out. It's on the Python Italia uh, YouTube account. Finally, let me talk about the cost of everything that I'm doing, which is not obvious, but you know, actually setting up the green screen was not really easy, especially because in Italy I just had an actual green screen. In here, there's not like the space, the way to do it, I had to buy it. So what I actually did is to buy green papers and attach them on the wall. It kind of worked. I think the effect is nice enough. Uh, I also had to buy, of course, light, uh, lights. I've got a couple of lights, both by IKEA, because I'm in Sweden, obviously. So it kind of works, but I'd like to improve that. So I've done this and this, which is already a lot of money, especially now that I'm living by myself, I have to pay for food and everything. I haven't yet bought uh, something that I think I need, which is a front facing light. And I would also like a secondary microphone uh, of the kind that you can actually attach to your t-shirt because, uh, you know, holding this is not always the best idea. And if I use the tripod, it's too far anyway. So also I would like to buy a new camera that will actually improve the quality a lot, not just for this kind of videos, but I'm doing other videos as well, uh, such as um, uh, my secondary channel, which you don't know about, but I do have one. So that's expensive. I want a good one. I do have some money aside, uh, thanks to various donations over time. However, um, I'm not too confident spending all of them at once. So if you'd like to help me out, you've got some links that you can use to help me out. There's a one-time uh, donation through PayPal or a subscription to pay, uh, through Patreon, sorry. And Patreon subscribers also get some special posts about what's happening and everything. Also access to a special uh, Twitter, Telegram, sorry, chat. And by the way, thank you a lot to all of the people that actually supported me through this time because I haven't published a video in a lot and still I receive donations and stuff. So thank you to everybody. And now that I'm back, I'd like to make sure that that money goes into the right things, the right camera, the right equipment. I've already bought a lot of things. So I hope that truly really, uh, works off. And of course I now, especially now needs need a little money to eat and everything. So donations are particularly uh, appreciated. So that is actually everything. And now I will start publishing videos every day. So if you want another, just wait for tomorrow and it'll be out. So see you tomorrow with another video.